Check out this property we got on ruralvacantland.com. This one's in Northern California, and it's just a, it's a, it's a grassy field. It's five acres. It looks like a great place that like let the horses go crazy, or goats or chickens. I mean, you could raise a lot of chickens on that grass. You could probably plant some more, you know, different kinds of wild grasses in there and mix it up and have a go at it. Let's take a look at this property. Um, so this is Northern California. The property, this one is Leonard Shield. This is in Butte County. It's Butte County, California. I'll pull up some maps in a little bit. He's asking $90,000 for this five acres. He's got pictures. He's got sent somebody over there to get some actual pictures. This is a picture I was just looking at in the background. Here's a view off over the area. Somebody's doing some greenhouses. Um, and this is like a wintertime picture, but in the, in the spring and summer, these trees, I'm sure, are lighting up in their awesome green colorness. Looks like a windmill in the background, maybe. <laughs> um, so here's a tree. There's some pine trees. I think that's an oak tree. It's just scattered farmlands off into the distance in different areas. There's a power line down here. You can see a power line running through this valley. We'll see. I'm not sure if there's one to the property or not, but they're in the area. It, you can see some... Uh, um, mobile home, motor, motor, motor home kinds of lodging in the area. This is the drive. So it's a dirt drive coming up to the property. So this is one of the borders of the property here. So you can drive right up to it and then it's just in the grass from there. And this is different shots of the grasslands. Uh, looks like a old table and chairs set up under the tree. Looks like a good spot to have a picnic. Here's the road coming into it. It almost looks like there's frost on that road. They might have got there early in the morning. And uh, yeah, so it just pulls in and then it, this is the, the grasslands, you know, that we're looking at. So here's the property. This looks like maybe the trail the picture guy walked up to take those pictures. It's a little bit of a bluff right here, but I mean, it, it, you go up or down one way or the other, you could probably just drive right into that field and find a spot to drive into it if you wanted to go park on it, start using it. It looks like a pretty easy place to, to go to work and make it happen. Some more pictures, different ways. Green up top and a little bit grayer grasses down below. This is probably where it's getting more sun or more morning sun in this part of the field. Just looks like a solid five acres of, of land where stuff actually grows. Um, so here's a shot from above. It looks like there's a maybe a school bus or something next to it and some old cars, you know, car collection. So I think you could probably pull in here in your RV and these kinds of people aren't going to complain, I'm guessing. And uh, you could probably go for it. There's that tree. So there's a picture. The pictures are showing that tree. You can see that tree is on the property. Let's blow this up. Um, yeah, so there's more greenhouses. You can see the greenhouses over here. So this little road seems to go out past these houses out to the bigger road. It looks like it keeps going out to a road going the other direction too. So it looks like you could access it from this way or that way from the east or west. There's a pond, some streams in the area, a couple more ponds, scattered ponds around the area. So the water level probably isn't that deep. Let's see what uh, lake and town we're in here. Is that or? Orville, Lake Orville or something. Okay, I'm hitting the wrong stuff. Let's see. Um, yeah, Orville. So Lake Orville, that's like huge, massive dam, right? Um, can tell by the shape of it. <laughs> yeah, Lake Orville. So there's a property. There's Lake Orville. And uh, here's the town of Orville, South Orville and South of here. We're going to go down to, um, to uh, yeah, Yuba City. I was thinking Sacramento. But there's here's the property. Here's Yuba City. Here's Sacramento. And I've had properties all, all along here. Here's San Francisco. So this property, $90,000, nice green, easy to grow, not covered in trees. You can go plant stuff on it property. I think we'll, we'll get some attention. Somebody will go for this one. Um, so we've got uh, an address at $90,000. GPS coordinates, if you want to go take a look at it. County, Butte County, I already said that. Zoning is A5, so agricultural, five-acre kind of thing. Property tax, $318 a year is the last property tax that, that came on it. And uh, there you go. So if you're interested in this one in Butte County, Northern California, 
please go to the website, ruralvacantland.com. Follow the link in the description of this video. It'll take you back to the website. You can click on uh, Leonard's phone number, 702-602-1939, if you want to call him and ask more about this or go take a tour. Check out this property. See if this is the right one for you. And uh, see you in the next one. Thanks for listening. Thanks. See you. Bye.